Hi guys, and welcome to D Street. <laughs> so as the title tells you, I have um, just completed my art gallery. I didn't even give the last, I didn't even give the last art pieces of art for you. I'm just, I'm just bleary eyed from the amount of time spent farming. Um, and I wanted to start in my room because I wanted to show you guys some good things I got from Red before uh, I show you the completed art. So first of all, hi, welcome to D Street. Um, if you haven't already, follow me on Twitch, D underscore street, or Instagram, Dominica D underscore street. Um, so first, look at my collection of bears. These are the, the normal sets of bears. You see the, the regular bears that you can customize, the panda bears. But Red offers you a set of bears as well. Papa bear, mama bear, and baby bear, all in these plaid colors, um, patterned colors. So there's that. I wanted to start here. Um, I am in a Christmas dress for a reason. I'm very superstitious, and the first, within the first hour of doing this farm, uh, Cranston gave me both this halo and this dress, and I thought, what a troll. I put it on, I started getting a bunch of stuff, and then I kept it on for the entire time. So like I said, it's been 59 hours straight of farming red. If you haven't already, check out my other videos on my Twitch to see how to farm red, because there is a specific way to do it. So red was on my island July 9th, I mean June 19th, it's now June 20th. So we're going to, oh, thank you so much for the sub. Um, I know this is on YouTube, but I am streaming this live on Twitch as we speak. So what you guys are going to be seeing right now is a YouTube video, but this was streamed live on my Twitch. Okay, so I'm going to get the last piece of art. That's just not even going to throw it away. Um, of course I got that. Let me just see, make sure. It's nighttime, of course, and I'll tell you why, because just in case I get this wrong, I'm gonna... Okay, Valiant Statue. Okay, so that should be the last statue I need. And let's go to the museum and check this out. I carry my net with me at night because these scorpions don't play. Obviously, there's going to be a lot of weeds. Um, doing this for so long, I had probably over 400 weeds I had to pick up. My friend came over and took all the flowers that started growing all over the place um, and helped me clear that up. Um, actually, let me concentrate. I have a mission. Let me not pick up the weeds right now. <laughs> okay. We're not even going to put down the arcade seat. Okay. My blue roses and my purple windflowers have been growing like crazy. All right, let's go this away. All right, so after I donate to Blathers, this, this, I'm, I'm 99.999% sure this is the correct Valiant statue. Why do I have two there? Don't know why, but don't care. Oh, that's the fake one. Okay. I'm going to show you all of the art, where they belong, and also how to tell if it's real or fake. There it is. The last donation. Oof. That was a long one, guys. 59 hours straight. I don't understand what Nintendo's thinking. Even if you, even time manipulators are having trouble with red, and they expect people who don't manipulate time to get 43 works of art, it's like in 300, I did this almost 300, so I did uh, over 300 hops. 300. That's like years, like 10 years of doing this. Well, anyway, wait, actually let me back out first and then go back in. Okay, so we're backing out just to let it reset. I don't know how Blathers works, but I'm going to do it that way. And here we go. Oh, I'm excited for this. Here we go. 
So let me just get a screenshot for my thumbnail right here. I know you're going to see this in real time. It's so funny. We're going to get a, a screenshot for my thumbnail. Perfect. Ah, thank you for the congratulations, guys. <laughs> okay, here we go. So first, I'm just going to go a once around. Um, as you can see, I have all the statues up front. I have a whole line artwork. Another wing of art. Another statue. More works of art. I call this the always, um, this the, I'll just get to it later. This was one of the last three statues. This statue right here was the second to last. You can see I have this area in this area. And before I get into how to tell if it's real or fake, this one right here, let's take a picture with it. This valiant statue, the elusive valiant statue. Oh, you can turn the lights up in the museums? Oh, no, no, you can't. Do I want dramatic? No, I don't. I, th I thought those were the light. <laughs> I thought these were the lights. Okay, let me just be sharp. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Oof. So let me let you guys know real quick. See this statue? If she has an earring on her right ear, right here, it's fake. This statue, if it's blue, it's a fake. Motherly statue, if she has a tongue sticking out, fake. See how this statue is holding like a frisbee? If he's wearing a Rolex, it's a fake. The Valiant statue's fake is basically the same statue, but mirrored. So the fake will have the opposite leg forward. This statue was a t pain in my butt. Because this statue was hard to get, but this statue's fake has a necklace on it. This statue's fake right here, the statue, the Michelangelo statue of David. If he's holding a book in his right hand, it's a fake. And the last statue in the front, this thinking statue, I think it's called familiar, is always real. It's always genuine. Buy it as soon as you see it. Matter of fact, I have two in my pocket right now. This painting right here, the jolly one right here, it's real when it has a like a sprout coming out of the chest. It's fake when it does not. This painting right here, you can see in the two trees, um, there are two people. The fake won't have those people. Um, oh, thank you guys, thank you guys. Uh, Mona Lisa will have makeup on. That's how you know it's fake. The academic. The academic picture right there in the middle, um, see how it's all white? The fake will have on the upper right corner a coffee cup stain, like someone put a coffee cup on it. Um, this one was another difficult one to find. I think it's called Serene. Yeah, it's Serene. So the Serene painting was difficult to find. See how that ferret is all white? It'll be a gray ferret if it's fake. This... Artwork right here. The top right corner has um, trees. You can see that. The fake one will not have trees. Basically, it'll just be empty on the top right corner. As we move up to here, this painting right here, it's pretty difficult. When you see it in Red's boat, you're going to have to zoom in on this photo because I could barely see it when Red's boat is so dark. The middle man with the red sla sash has a hat on. In the fake one, he doesn't wear a hat. So you have to keep that, you have to cap keep that in mind. Girl with a pearl earring is easy to tell if it's fake because her earring will be a star if it's fake. Um, this is another difficult painting to tell. If it's fake, I think it's called quaint. Yeah, quaint. 
See how the stream of water is really, really thin out of the jar? If it's a thick, like, pour of water, it's fake. Um, another one, which is, was difficult to find but easy to tell if it's a fake, the man in the back at the doorway, see how his hand is touching the uh, doorway? If his hand is lifted off and there's a space in between, fake. This is another statue that's always real. So I think this is the, I don't know, a great statue, always real. Oh, you're welcome, guys, for the guide. <laughs> this was this was rather difficult. I don't know what Nintendo's thinking. I don't know what Animal Crossing is, Crossing is thinking. Ten years in this game to get an art wing? Be quiet. All right, so this painting, do you see how his hair is kind of, like, um, scarce as his bangs? The fake one will have a bowl cut as his hair, so it'll be full. It'll be a bowl cut. Um, this will be always real. So this painting right here, warm painting, will always be real. I call it the Titanic painting, but always real. Another one that's always real is this um, Worthy, I think, or Solemn. Is it Solemn or Worthy? Worthy painting is always real. Glowing painting, always real. Um, this is the, I call it the Big Head statue, but this is not called Big Head statue, Rocket statue. So do you see how he's like straight faced? Uh, the fake, he'll be smiling. So you'll know if he's smiling, it's fake. Okay, so this is, I call this the wall of reels. Whenever you see any of these, any of these pictures, any of these artworks, any of these artworks, any of these artworks, always real, always genuine, always genuine, always genuine, more genuine. Twinkling, twinkling, we all know, genuine. Flowery, genuine, genuine. So we have all these genuine, genuine, all the time. Buy them. So this is all genuine. Buy them. Um, so this statue on this left side, he doesn't come with the small statues behind him. He comes by himself, the warrior. You can tell if he's fake if he's holding a shovel. If he's holding an Animal Crossing shovel, it's going to be fake. So this one's real, of course. And then once you donate him, the other uh, statues come behind him. And then this tremendous statue, um, this, okay, so this is actually kind of cool because I thought, it, I call it Bronzong because he looks like Bronzong from Pokemon. So the fake one looks like Bronzong. The fake one will have a cover, like a lid with like a cap. I actually have it in my pocket, so I'll, I'll put it down for you guys to see. It'll, it'll look like a handle, like almost like it's a cover. So you don't want that. Um, this one is easier to tell, but so... Do you see how it's blue, kind of blue flowers? Um, and if you have trouble telling blue and indigo apart, you might have trouble figuring it out. They've accommodated for that by adding that little, so uh, there's like a little drop with like a red circle on the left side. The fake one will not only have different color flowers, I believe it's gonna be purple flowers, it'll have no red dot with the line. So keep that in mind. This was, this graceful was pretty difficult to tell. Oh, wrong one. My bad. Red is terrible. Red took 59 hours of my life. Oh, I'm, I'm in the way. Hold on, I'm in the way. I can't tell you what this is about. So graceful was hard. Let me show you graceful. As you can see, there's, there's actually two fake ones he gives you with graceful. This was tricky because I, I had a fake one in my home and I thought it was real. So the white tags on her hair. She has one on top and one on the right. They will, the one on the right will be missing on the fake one. Also, there is a mirrored version of her that have that, it has the tags, but it's a mirrored version, also fake. Keep that in mind when you're looking for the graceful painting. This water one right here on the right is always real. This angry one, this angry soldier, you can tell when he's real because he's angry and when he's fake, He's like worried. Uh, this one's actually, the fake one's actually cooler than this one. So this one, the fake one has like glowing blue eyes and antennas like he's from the future. It's actually pretty cool, but it's fake. So this one's real. This can get rather confusing because this is called the right one and that one's called the left one. And so, you know, at first I thought they were swapped. 
and that's the trick of it. The right one looks like this. It has the, the, the darker demon, and the left one has the lighter demon. So the fakes will be swapped. The fake right one will be this left one, and the fake left one will be this right one. So the fake, it'll just switch the color schema. Um, again, this is my YouTube video that I'm uploading, but I am streaming this live, and I have to give a big shout out to acrystal87 for all those subs you just dropped in my channel. Thank you so much for unlocking all these emotes. I'm happy, to, I'm so excited to share them, and we are going to continue ASAP. Okay, so there's that. And that completes the art gallery. The art wing is complete. No more red. I hate that guy. I hate that guy. And I will say, I actually decorated Red's area before he came and visited me. And coincidence? I don't think so. All right, so right here I'm going to just do, hey, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Let me just, let me just make sure I save this. Can you imagine? 